Hey, don't get all tense here. If we wanted you dead, you'd wake up dead already. No two ways about that. Huh? <laughs> Hell yeah! So don't you worry, pal. Sal wants to make you offer, so listen. <laughs> so, here we meet again. Did you forget how you knocked me out back then? I sure remember. My head still hurts, you see? <laughs> I also remember that you didn't kill me when you could. So here you go. Eight bullets in the cylinder, you see? Cost me two tons of water, so be gentle with it. But that was just foreplay. Time for business. I figure you'd want to know why I rushed you then. Do you know our Baron? Well, I basically had him on a plate already, you see? Hmm. I spent five years sucking up to him and roughing up the damn locals for him. I even got his custom van for that service. Ah, don't sweat it. <laughs> you can keep it. I have more than one car. So, to cut to the chase, I almost lost that crazy witch on his ass. She was supposed to whack him, and I had all the preparations in place. Rast, Vach, Tiri, Tamki, you see? And that's the moment you guys choose to arrive at. Train and all. The Baron, with his paranoia, immediately decides that you are a new gang from the West. How to get him specifically. And all my planning goes to the shitter. Lock all the doors, triple the guards, the whole shebang. That girl lost any chance of getting close enough to him. But now I think this might even be for the better. <laughs> Besides, you just helped that girl out of the lighthouse and freed the slaves from the ship dismantling operation. Don't worry, we caught most of them by now. <laughs> but still, that was a good distraction. Now the Baron is sure you're targeting his business, too. In any case, I'll be frank. Neither you nor I are interested in Baron staying alive, so I say, whack him for good. You seem to be up to the task. I can still feel the thrashing you gave me. <laughs> Consider the gun and the car in advance payment. If you do take Baron out, I'll make sure none of the boys take chasing you too seriously. Then we'll be even. If you fuck up, no skin off my back either. I'll just save the Baron from the evil gang out to get him. And he'll crown me by his own hand. <laughs> so, think about it. You still have time. Leaving already. Hey, leaving already.
This dust will be the end of me. Look at my lair here. Didn't have such luxury back in Moscow. Still, this place is too hot. I feel I'm coming down soon, like Stepan. In any case, here's what I learned. See that crane at the dock? There is someone in the cabin. Can't see him that well, but I think he noticed me as soon as I arrived. That seems like a great spot to keep tabs on our base, so you should check it out. Look at that cracked ship now. The largest one, closest to the water. See? Well, it's not cracked, but rather carefully dismantled. I saw trucks carrying cages arrive at that boat. Looks like this is where the bandits keep their prisoners. There's that building over there, past the port. Looks like an air control tower, but I'm not sure. In any case, there should be a lot of equipment there. Something might come in handy. I see you got the maps. You and Demir did a great job there. <coughs> I'll keep watching the rigs, and you can choose your next goal. Damn, I wish I could wash off all this sand already. I hope we get out of this desert soon. If you're going to the port, there's a convenient zip line on the roof. Be careful out there, all right?
Дорогой, have a seat, no? Copy that. We got some water for you. It became quite scarce for you. Right. Miller, over and out. You got them? Great job, Artyom. Great news. Artyom got the maps. Well done, Artyom. That is such a relief. Idiot. Get started with these. I'll join you later. Yeah. There's a lot have of seat. data. The sooner we analyze it, the better. We have the maps. Now we have to find a way out of this place. And that's the hard part. We need water for the Aurora and the crew, as you can see. Stepan, Duke, and Alyosha are done with dehydration already. We also need fuel. The local bandits have it all. I had already contacted their so-called Baron, but his terms proved to be unacceptable. He'll told us where they get the water, but naturally, the well is guarded. The mirror recalls the place, and says we could infiltrate it stealthily. So, party, when you're ready, go rendezvous with the mirror. Your goal is to bring water to the Aurora. Failure is not an option. Good luck, Artyom. I... We are all counting on you. Crest, how's the weather? The storm seems to be over. I'll go back to the post. Perfect. Grand Payermark, don't you have any... Uncle Artyom, is this for me? Wow, thank you! Look, Grand Payermark, I have my own canteen now. Well, now we will have to ask for some water. Then you'll have your own untouchable reserve. Wow, thank you! Mom, Uncle Artyom just gave me a canteen! What can I say? We clearly didn't come here in vain. Got it all figured out? Artyom, thanks for coming by to see the guys. I'm totally powerless here and it hurts. Stepan could never handle hot weather, but here without water... He never even said a word until he collapsed. Alyosha and Duke are down too. They just need some water, and I can't help them at all. Sure, everybody has it tough now, but just looking at them is painful. Try to think of something, will you, Artyom? Please. Sure seems so. The radiation levels are plotted in color. You can go wild there. Our situation is critical. A few more days, and we won't be able to fight off a pack of wild dogs, much less the bandits. Artyom, while you were out, I finished making one more thing for the Tihar. 
The workbench is at your service. Uh, so, did you try the new ammo out? Should work great with all this oil around. I figure the Holy Flame would be pretty happy with them. Hmm? <laughs> I'm feeling kinda under the weather. Not my best day ever. And I'm not doing that poorly, all things considered. I think we can last another couple of days like this. Maybe. We need water. We really do. Well, let's hope the situation didn't deteriorate since then. Which maps have we got? Central Asia, Western Siberia, the Urals, the European part of the country. Aha, I see. Yeah. No Far East. Weird. I see two options here. Either the Far East was out of the satellite center area. Or? Or somebody snatched all the maps of the East before us. If that is the case, they still left plenty for us. Where should we look, Colonel Sir? I'd forget about the large cities. They were priority targets. Still, going for the deepest end of nowhere isn't too attractive either. But this place seems clean. Ah, no wonder. It's just a step. What if we go north? North, uh... No good. See? There's a lot of fallout here. Should have gone milder after 20 years, but I still wouldn't advise a prolonged stay there. Yeah, this is going to take a while. Check this railroad out. It's most probably the one we're going to use to get out of here. Yes, it does look like the only way out for us now. And that is why we should study it in as much detail as we can. What if we take this fork? A lake? A river? Radiation's not too high either. Hmm. Seems promising. This place is somewhat unusual, though. Yes. A large spot to the north. But the place itself looks clear. There is also some intact infrastructure. We are lucky that most of the local bandits went raiding a while back. Otherwise... They sure would have come knocking at our door by now. Uh, so what do you think of our situation, Artyom? Not so good, huh? Now, besides, we had guests, too. Gave them our best welcome, naturally. Well, the beasts ran straight into Stepan with his mint grinder, and he just minced them. We rushed out, but only saw the bodies. One of the bodies, blood, was Stepan's. Now, at first, I thought the bastards got him. Nah, he didn't even have a scratch on him. It was a freaking heat stroke. He's down in the station building now, resting. <laughs> The rest of the guys are not in a great shape either, so if those oil bandits decide to put real pressure on us, we are screwed. Extermination! My word. As you were, everyone, the 
Artyom, thanks for dropping by again. Saw anything interesting out there? I sure haven't. I guess I really should ask Dad for a reassignment. <coughs> then again, we do need an observer here. Good luck, Artyom. Drop by again if you have time. <coughs> That sniper doesn't seem to be an amateur. I see him. Just a moment. Damn. Sweat got in my eyes. Can't hit the bastard. Now. 